WFNN. Headline News Update. Welcome, folks. We have the Dow Industrials trading down 692, NASDAQ off 528, S&P's off 107. Gold, gold contract up $10.20, trading at 2,483 an ounce. We have silver down 49 cents, $28.44 an ounce. Late sweet crude up uh, down $1.33 at $76.58 a barrel. Notes and bonds. 10-year note up 28 ticks, 112.22. They broke topside with volume. Third year but also broke topside with volume. It's up a full point, plus 24 ticks at 122.17 in King Dollar. King Dollar's up uh, 328 ticks, 104, 424, euro at 107, yen at 149, British pound at 127 to 1 US dollar. Let's go take a look at these markets. No bounce all day. This market, well, you know, the, that what was happening, folks, in the, this morning is that Asia and Europe were telling us we we're going down. You know, the excitement was all there this morning, but guess what? Asia, Asia was down all night long. Europe was down all night long. And you can see, when we look at these queues, the, the NQ, so the NQs, there's been no bounce at all. Now, the last time that we had any volume on the way down was quite a long time ago, man. So this is a trip, there's no doubt. If we go to the You'll see what the queues did, but they went right by it, actually. The queues were the last ones to do this. The spy filled this gap first, and then the queues came down, went by the gap. The gap on the queues was 459.29. We're at 456. And we'll see if we get anything coming out of the close, meaning. And that's what, what, what's intriguing here, though. See this right here? This is actually a last engulfing. So this is actually testing last Friday's. Is that Friday's? Uh, one, two, three. Yeah, Friday's. We're going into Friday's lows, and we're doing that with lighter volume. So more than likely, we'll probably get some kind of a bounce tomorrow. We might get the bounce coming into the close here. Let's see, as soon as we I get up and go here, I'll start right off with the S&Ps, too. Stay right there, folks. Come right back.